alafu nani akaambia nani Hey guys welcome back to Fast Fast Gossips 254 it's your boy Malo Okay so Fox News TV host Emily Kompanya is the latest foreign celebrity to face the wrath of Kenyans on Twitter's online attacks after she claimed that Kenyan pregnant women couldn't leave their houses hence had no constructive right to vote The insularity of these celebrities so asinine to me it's so nauseating because these comments totally delusional right so she's talking about like what, what voting rights that we have less voting rights here what about in Kenya where pregnant women can't leave the house so they absolutely have no constructive right to vote or in Oman where women have to vote as their husbands do Many Kenyans felt that her utterances were not only misleading but demeaning to Kenyan women too by Thursday hashtag which Kenya was trending on Twitter with ordinary citizens celebrities and politicians all joining forces to condemn the former National Football League cheerleader many are now calling her out to apologize here are some of the reactions we sampled kitui governor charity ngilu tweeted wait what in kenya pregnant women can't leave the house at emily kompanyo probably start by locating kenya on the map first maybe at fox news at fox news politics kenyan journalist linda ogutu tweeted good evening fellow kenyans am i living in a different kenya at emily kompanyo which kenya is this please nairobi woman rep esther pasari said Pregnant women in Kenya can vote. Retract your statement. Digital media strategist Pauline Joroge tweeted at Fox News. What is this? What is Emily Companion saying that in Kenya pregnant women can't leave the house so they have no right to vote? What does she imagine our country is like? That statement is incorrect, misleading, condescending and should be withdrawn. Kenyan musician Susanna Owiyo tweeted, "Really? Which Kenya? Very misleading." at Emily Companion withdraw that statement never heard of pregnant women in Kenya being denied rights to vote totally unacceptable another twitter user tweeted pregnant women the sick and the elderly are actually given the first priority to vote in Kenya which Kenya is Emily Companion referring to so what's your opinion on this do you think Emily Companion was out of line or are Kenyans just overreacting let us know in the comment section below give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and we will talk soon bye